Hello there, I am Giant Girl from my Pokemon Emerald. In the last part, we took on the rest of the trainers in Mount Pyre in the Graveside area. And we made it to Route 123. And I don't have Cut with me, but I think there's a Red Candy back there in a couple battle tra trainers you can battle. I think two of them are psychics. The two are psychics. Okay, talk to this girl. It's very important. I love Grass Step Pokemon. Do you like. Do you have any Grass Step Pokemon? Oh, you. You like grass Pokemon too, don't you? I'm so happy you can have this as a token of our friendship. TM19 Giga Drain. Fair worth getting. I check trees with my grass type Pokemon. I'm like a tree doctor. <laughs> so I'm gonna actually teach Giga Drain to shrooms. So let me do that. And it's right here. You have to Giga Drain. A very, very, very powerful move. Which move should be forgotten? Yep. And it should be... Let's get rid of Mega Drain. So here's my final move set for Shrooms. Just, I have my final move set with Peter, which is actually surf, uh, fly, stealing, and... Okay, and I think that was it. But like my final move set for my, uh... My final move set for Peter was surf, Fly stealing and what was the last move? Shell Clive, yep, okay, and then so my final move set for shrooms would be Skyper Cut, Giga Drain, Mac Punch, and Oich Seed, I just see right here. So that's cool. So I have Prime Froze, pick some berries right here. Very worth picking up two Petra Berries so I can cure poison twice and uh, use it use those berries to cure poison twice. Here's citrus berries, which are nice. Like in the heal, 30, 30 HP, which is really good actually. It, has to be, it can be used as a held item to your Pokemon, so that's awesome. Then the frost berries, again, cure um, burn. So nice. I didn't hit an item in this rock. What about on this rock? What about on this rock? <laughs> you always check the rocks, I guess. I don't think there's any hands here though. Put a super pull on. Not, not max repel, super pull. Nice. Can, you can use cut to, to avoid the wild grass. So yeah, the tall grass. Not pyre where the two bits of Pokemon sleep. Will you will your Pokemon sleep? Well, if you put me, to, if you put my Pokemon to sleep, yeah. When t when there are no trainers around, I let my Pokemon battle each other. I watch them. I guess that's good for practice, but like if it's to the faint to the point where they faint each other, that's kind of cool. Collector Ed and the other Hex Maniac, whatever. What to do? What to do? I think we should. I think we should take on the Zangus first. Or the Deskull. Hmm. Let's take out the Zangoofs first, actually. The Ice Beam hits, how nice. Iron Tail hits again, nice. Because the Zangoofs. It's a Viper, ooh. You're thinking I'm a ghost type? Death Skull. Seriously? Ice Beam and Iron Tail, I guess. No. Let's use Headbutt. This five seems like the more th the, the one that, with the more threat. Right, that has some more threat to it. Flinch, nice. Okay. The rain continues the fall. Ice beam on the dust skull and let's slap on the cipher. There we go. Okay, there we go wasn't very effective. So yeah. sit straight and 
Ice Beam again, I guess, and Headbutt. This Duskull should faint. There we go, it's gonna faint. Oh, I forgot the normal type moves don't affect ghost type moves. How could I forget something like that? My goodness. Fine, let's just use Water Gun and Mud Slap then. There we go. Level 37 for Prime, nice. A Shepherd, huh? Not so it's accuracy. Okay, the shop it's gonna be. Okay, fainted. It's fainted now. Okay, cool. Thanks for the twenty-five dollars and twenty cents. I believe that was. Not in my bag. I don't want to go to my bag. Let's go to Prime. Let's put Blaine up front, I guess. Uh, these rocks have items in them. There's a hyper potion, nice. Here's some leopard berries, I think. Yep, leopard berries, that's right. It's for four of them. Pretty cool. I think there's a hidden item in there somewhere. There we go, super repel. Neoxer. Okay, here's a, I'm guessing a Roma lady or a cool trainer, I'm not sure. Want to determine how, want to determine how strong you are? Well, I'll battle, I'll be the test. Okay, I think this might be a cool trainer. Okay, I know my my wild is um still type, so I'm gonna go for the flamethrower. This should one hit kill it. Let's see. There we go. It's super effective. Level thirty seven. Nice. Pelipper. Well, it's gonna be. Should I, who who needs more? Who's closer to all of others? Uh, Peter or uh, Speedy? Um, I'll put Peter up front, or I'll put Peter out. Yeah, nice. It's Pelipper versus Pelipper. Except for my Pelipper is cooler, cause it knows Shockwave. There we go, when it killed it. Celia, okay. No move, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use Fly. Grass will miss this, cause I'm in the air. Oh man, it missed. And we won't miss apparently, because they're all in this situation. If I was still in the air, it would miss most likely. If I was underwater, it would miss most likely. And if I was underground, I'd miss most likely. It's like the only exception with moves like Magic Leaf and Swift and all that. Moves kind of like that. And it shouldn't miss this time. There we go. Nice. There we go. There goes Rosalia. This Rosalia should give me a bunch of experience too. Well, 940, that's decent, you know, cool. You passed with flying calories. Thanks, thanks for the 20, $27.84. Okay, I actually accidentally talked to you again after the bomb, so sorry. I'm, I don't ever do that, bro. This is what path we could take. Let's take on this trainer first. Wayne. Let's put speed up front. 
You seem to have a big collection of gym badges. Let me see if you're actually worthy of those badges. Well, I, I proved I was worthy the day I got them, bro. You're like, oh, that's proof if you're worthy or not. Yeah. Like, are you kidding me? Guess well. It is raining. Thunderbolt attack. Mudsop on this thing. Gotta keep on using Mudsop till it faints, basically. That's the goal. That's the plan. Get okay, two Mudsops to faint this thing. I'm gonna lower its accuracy. Thunder Wave, ouch. I'm gonna heal Paralysis after I'm done fainting this Mind Taunt because it might use Thunder Wave again once as soon as I heal and stuff, or right after I heal. Ah, uh, no. Oh, it's paralyzed crap. This stinks. Let's just use... Let's use a super potion again. Right, let's use a super... Why not? Oh, I say again. Just use a super potion. Okay, this magnet ton's gonna be really annoying. Dang it. Oh, I miss. I'm just gonna go for it. Come on. No, I meant to not go back to my bag. I'm gonna go and use my sap again. Thunderbolt, okay. Hopefully I love this. I probably won't, but we'll see. Oh my gosh, you're kidding me. You stupid magneton. I hate you. Oh man, what moves does Speedy have again? No, I think that'd be good against that. Dang it. Fine, we'll put in Blaine. Avenge Knight's death or Knight's faintness because he fainted. Avenge Knight is what I'm trying to say. Trap wrench. Let's go to Peter. Okay, this trap and just shouldn't be a problem. Hopefully it won't be a problem. Surf attack. <laughs> yeah, one more. <laughs> one more. All this rain. It's kind of giving me a headache. Let's go for the shockwave. The shockwave hits. Nice. Okay, there we go. Watch just another shockwave just so it won't miss. You know what? I'm, I'm risking it. Well, actually, I shouldn't have to risk because like, I can with just any water move right now. So, you know. Choose a yellow fruit. Of course, you use a hyper potion. Gosh, you had to freaking confuse me again. Are you kidding me? Water Pulse. I know confusion only has a 10% rate of 10% chance of confusion, but how much does Water Pulse have? Oh my gosh. Come on. This is so annoying. Just don't use. Oh my gosh. Just. Come on. It's not that hard. Come on. Peter, hit, hit, hit. No, don't hit yourself. No. No. Okay, fine. 
I'm gonna be a jerk and wither me down to my last HP. Fine, but I will not allow it. I'm healing up all my poke. I'm healing up my whole Pokemon status. Uh, HP bar. Dang, I hate going back to my back by accident. Come on, just don't hit yourself. Come on. I should just use my freaking yellow flute. In fact, that's what I'm gonna do this time. This battle is just dragging on, and I don't like that. Ha, huh, take that. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Seriously? That's stupid. Just stop confusing me. I'm gonna keep on spamming my yellow flute then until that stops. You better not confuse me this time. Thank you. Jeez. Freaking shockwave it. I'm glad you're fainted now. When will you suck? That was stupid. That whole thing was stupid. Let's go, Speedy. Your strength. Could have quite nice, I'll take it. I'm worried though, thanks. Thanks for twenty-six dollars and eighty-eight cents. Yeah, this is still an I'm, I'm smack in the middle of a triathlon. But hey, I've got, always got time to short. Shoot the breeze. Working out with my po with Pokemon feels mighty good. Without exchanging words, we si we cinch as if we shared a heart. It's inspiring. Gasps, chatting while running. I'm going to run down. Gasps, have to go. Except for the rifle hope. No, okay, yeah, no, no, no. That was on the ground. My bad. These look like bird keepers or cool trainers. But yeah. I turn your lights out. I'll turn your lights out while I rip through this t this tone. Okay, guitars. I have to tell you, bird Pokemon are my obsession. Birds are cool. They're the best. So, guitars and a bird keeper, huh? I think I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use Thunderbolt on the Pelipper and then I'm gonna use Surf on the Electric. There we go. Nice. Hack Sue. Or is that too my bad? I'm gonna use I think I'm gonna use strength on the Loundred and Shockwave on well I can use surf on both of them. So I'm gonna use surf on that and both of them actually. Nice. Here we go. Level 37 for speedy. Hey, hold it. I was still playing the intro. Even in defeat by Pokemon are cool. Thanks for $30.40, guys. Oh my gosh, not another Pokemon adventure. Oh, and I'm there? Okay. 
Another double battle. Let's see here. If everyone's level 37, but I might actually take the time to revive Knight. If I can find my new revives. There we go. Hello, child. Can you spare some time? Okay, uh, uh, expert and a psychic. Okay, so we're gonna use flamethrower on the planet, uh, on the cadet, I guess. I think I used Hepa on the Makita. Or I used Iron Tail on the Makita. Or on the cadet, but dang it. I didn't plan that out that well. <laughs> but, but Iron Tail still hits, so that's good. Wonder Tone. Dang it, that's gonna hurt. Okay, we gotta take out the well, this is a bad matchup because the Maki does good against my knight and the Wutone's good against my plane. Fine. Just take out the Maki And there we go. Nice. My choke. Oh, great. This isn't really a good matchup. Let's use headbutt on the on my choke and thumbs it on the choke. There we go. And oh man, it's so close to fainting. Then my trick finished out oh, awesome. I took the future side attack, are you kidding me? Fine, which is the mud slap on the machoke then. And the overheat on the line of tone. Didn't do much, dang it. Are these confusion on night? Are you kidding me? Seriously? You jerk. I'm putting an end to this. Well, I could have just went for. I forget. I always forget that you know. That um, Peter's the one with surf, and then Prime is the one with bulb boom and water gun. Flamethrower, I guess. Another Pokemon adventure, way to go. Uh, way to be, I don't know. And there's this item right here. And I'm gonna fly back up to Loy Cove because I think there's one spot, the top part of this route where we didn't really get covered because of the split paths. So let's fly to Loy Cove again. So this has been on my Pokemon and we'll walk the guide part. And next part, we'll take on the rest of Route 123 and hopefully stop wherever Team Magma and Team Aqua went to. So this has been Jericho again. I'd like to watch you again. Goodbye and hope to see you guys in the next part of my Pokemon Elbow Walkthrough Guide.